Hello everybody. Welcome to this session. The objective of this session is to see how to change the material type of an existing material. Now, when I say an existing material, there could be a business scenario wherein you have created some materials and uh, by mistake you have got a wrong material type created and you would like to change the material type. Or there could be a possibility that a business has taken a decision to change the material type of certain materials. Now, uh, let me tell you that if in case a material is already in use and the transactional data is already available for any materials, then the material type cannot be changed just like that. It has to have a very, very high level approvals and it has to have a very valid business scenario that why the material type of that certain material is getting changed. Then only they, it can be changed, otherwise it cannot be changed. And before that, all the entire purchasing data, everything has to be cleared and then only you could change the material type of that particular material. However, uh, this scenario is very apt if in case uh, you have certain materials and uh, uh, you have created newly, which is not yet uh, used, which is not yet even uh, purchased, but then you're going to purchase it. But uh, the thing is that you have actually uh, created, uh, you have selected a wrong material type and you'd like to utilize it instead of uh, deleting it or instead of recreating it. So how to do that? So for that, the uh, path is logistics. Then we have to go into materials management, material master, and then we have to go into material and the transaction code is MMAM. We can see here change material type. So click on this. Okay, uh, I do not want to change for this material right now. Let me pick up certain other materials. Let me go to MM60 to find the complete list of my plant right now, what all materials I have. Okay, I have um, R-0105. Let me check if I have any stock for this. So I'm just checking if I have any stock for this particular material right now in my plant. So the stock is currently zero. I do not have any stock. So um, I can change the material type for this one. All right, so let's go. Let's go to MMAM. All right, and now this is currently ZRO is my stroke. This is my raw material currently, and I think I would like to change it to a semi finished good. All right, so uh, my raw material, my um, Raw material is ZRO. Okay, let's go to MM60 again. Now you can see here, this is ZRO right now, right? This material type is ZRO. Now ZRO is my raw material for my plant, and I would like to change it to ZHAL, which is my semi finished code. You can see here, this is a semi finished code which I created. This is the material type. So I would like to change the uh, ZRO to ZHAL for this particular material. Okay, so let's go. Now, uh, before that, I would like to show you. There is certain important things that we need to check. In the accounting data one, you can see here the valuation class is 3000. Now, ideally, um, the valuation class for different material types is different. So, for example, if it is a raw material, the valuation class will be different. And if it is a semi finished, then the valuation class would be different. So, if I'm changing the material type of this material, automatically the valuation class will be changed. All right. And uh, uh, then you also need to select the price accordingly. However, I'm just showing the purpose of this demo is only to see, only to show how to change the material type. All right. So now I'm going to change to MMAM and we are going to say ZHAL. All right. And then I'm going to execute it. So here it says you are changing the material type from raw material to semi finished. So I say OK for this particular one. And you can see here. It says that this is a new valuation class 7910. It has automatically picked up the valuation class which is assigned for the uh, semi finished goods. So I will say OK. 
and system will automatically change the evaluation class and my material type as well. So you can see here the material type is changed. So let's see now. I would like to see that you can see here the material type it has picked up from ZRO to ZHAL. And it has also changed the valuation class here, 7910, right? Earlier it was 3000, if you remember, now it is 7910. The price it has not changed, but based on the valuation class, again, you need to recalculate if this price is good, not good, if that is a scenario. And if in case you'd like to change, you can again change all the other aspects also. You can use there are multiple ways to change that at a math level, all right? Now, if you go to the changes available, so I'm going to see the changes available for this particular material. So you can see here that today we have changed the material type from ZRO to ZHAL. All right. Thank you for watching this video. Have a great um, day. I hope you like it. So if you like it, please do subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much.